this episode of Engineering Career TV, I'm going to tell you how you can get an internship even if you are not attending a top tier engineering university. This topic was brought about by a question sent in from an engineering student named Ishan who asked, I've been listening to your podcast for a while now and I have greatly benefited from it. I am sure it will help me become a better engineer. Here's my question. As an engineering student, what is the best way to go about finding an internship if I am not from a top tier university and I have an average GPA? How should I go about contacting companies I am interested in? I am in my third year of mechanical engineering. So, Ishan is asking how he can find an internship at a company as a student with an average GPA and not in a top tier university. Unfortunately, Ishan, you've got a couple of things working against you. But you know what, Ishan? That doesn't necessarily matter because the best way to get an internship is to leverage your network. In fact, that is how most people actually get internships. They go through the people that they know, family members, colleagues, friends that they grew up with, professors, etc. You have to talk to everyone you know, Ishan, and try to get any internship to get you into the workplace, and that's really the bottom line. One of the things I would recommend that is a really powerful avenue to leverage is your alumni network. If your school has an alumni engineering network, then that's even better. Alumni often won't be overly concerned with GPA, and obviously, they'll love your school because they went there too and they often will want to help fellow alumni. So that would be a great place for you to start. So leverage your network as much as possible and reach out to your alumni network and see if you can find engineering graduates that would help you to find that internship that you are seeking. Best of luck. I hope you found this episode of Engineering Career TV helpful. Remember, you can go to engineeringcareercoach.com forward slash ask and submit your question. This show is for you and I want you to take full advantage of it. You can find all of the episodes categorized by topic at engineeringcareer.tv. If you would like to discuss issues like this and other engineering career goals and challenges, I recommend you join the Engineering Mastermind, an online support community we have created for engineers at theengineeringmastermind.com. For the price, you can't get more specific, targeted engineering career advice and assistance. The Engineering Mastermind is not about helping you survive as an engineer. It's about helping you thrive. This is Anthony Fasano, author of Engineer Your Own Success. Please subscribe to the show on YouTube or iTunes, and I'll see you next week.